live this is one for the record i'm diana and today is wednesday february 15th 2012 and let's see i guess what we'll do today is we have a lot of news today going on so let's start off with something something different okay on yahoo news I read lead found in lipstick. FDA found highest level in lipsticks made by Procter & Gamble, which is CoverGirl. Also in L'Oreal, Body Shop, and Maybelline, and Revlon. That's all my lipsticks. Oh, no. And it just doesn't affect... You women out there, how about you guys that are kissing women with lipstick on? And it looked like it was it looks like it was mainly the uh, red colors and a mauve and a couple of pink colors. Gosh. Well, you can go on to Yahoo News and check out the list. They did a whole list of them, but those are the the major ones. And now let's go to, that's terrible. When does it end? When does the poisoning ever end? Extinction protocol. 6.0 magnitude earthquake strikes off the coast of Oregon. And let's see what else we got going on here. Iran denies reports of cutting off oil exports to six EU nations. Greece entering death spiral as expulsion from EU looms. Heavy snow causes damage to Italy's historical landmarks. On the trail of powerful explosions reported in Russia. Hmm. Moving on to SOT.net. Netherlands deep freeze turns Amsterdam canals into ice skating rinks. U.S. hurricane force storm smacks Alaska, and it's been 30 degrees below average, while the lower 48 states ha has had an unusually mild winter. Also on SOT.net, uh, the earthquake 6.0 off the shore of Oregon was one of the largest recorded in that state. Peru earthquake 4.8 in Lima. Not fully understood. Disturbance rippled through Earth's magnetic field. Cool picture of Aurora Sky Station. Abisko National Park in Sweden. It's a very cool picture. And all, now we're going to move on to the Watchers. Mount Cleveland, Lava Dome. In Alaska, grows 25%, now is 50 meters. Oh, heads up, Alaska, Mount Cleveland. Also, Giovanna ravaged Madagascar and continues towards Mozambique. Heads up, Mozambique. Water spout seen over Auckland, New Zealand, and that's a very cool picture. So, yep, the Watchers has a very cool picture. Also, minor G1 class geometric storm underway. Activity intensified due to open crack in Earth's magnetic field. And there's a real cool picture of that one, too. Now, Miss Milky the Clown's channel. She reports thermometers possibly broken since reading 
went above 90 Celsius. I think that's in Fukushima number two. <coughs> that's what that's what the they're reporting over there. They think that the thermometer might be wrong. Yeah, okay. Sure it is. Uh, Recriticality xenon detected in number two, then denied. Update to 14-2012. Now, Miss Milky the Clown, she uh, went ahead and mirrored I C H I C A X four, I Chica X four, on YouTube uh, channel. Now it's excellent. What I did was go to my favorites. You could just watch it there. Go up to my favorites, click it. Look on the right, and this is you know go on my channel. Click it. Go on my right. Look at my favorites, and you'll see. I don't know why my face is itching. And you'll see, uh, I'm talking about radiation now. Ooh, I'm getting all itchy. Um, click it, and on the right, you will see what I favored. And watch it from there. Also, um, it looks like a repeat. <clears throat> it looks like a repeat, but it's not, because it'll continue on, and you'll even see uh, climate. Uh, you'll see uh, Nibiru Magic 2012's on there. It's a whole line. It's like a whole medley of an update for yesterday. It's just a whole update about Fukushima. And it shows, uh, heads up LA, it shows like the jet streams bringing it over. And uh, they also show the E energy e-news and more so it's a very long video it's like 14 minutes but it's worth it at the beginning it looks like that same guy reporting the 6.0 from his channel but then it, in Hansu but then it keeps going so you, you you'd want to watch that also what I did do I favored I watched this like a year ago and it was on CNN and uh, they showed uh, a UFO. It says aliens uh, stopping missile or something. And what it is is it shows uh, on the Larry King show. And the guy came on that was working on the missiles or something. And a UFO. First I thought maybe it could be a drone. No, it's round. So it wasn't a drone. And it came up. And it zapped the missile. Zip, zap, zap, zap. And it disarmed the missile. <clears throat> so it's very interesting. I did favor it for you. It's actually my last favorite, I think. So it's going to come up first. Again, go up to my favorites. Look on the right. And you'll see all of them. You might want to watch them. And uh, all I got to say about that one is... Obviously, we don't have the technology to disarm Fukushima. So maybe if my transmission is being picked up by, you know, any aliens out there, we, we might need your help to, dis, you know, extinguish uh, Fukushima because if... They don't want to shoot the fuel rods out into space like I have suggested to cool them off and get them out of here and off the planet. Well, space might have to come to you over there in Fukushima. Okay? So, I'm suggesting uh, if you're picking this up, you know, any ET uh, and extraterrestrials picking up this transmission or monitoring my channel for any reason uh it's been almost a year we can't put it out and it's destroying the planet hmm so maybe that's a good way for that's a good way for them to show up and show that they're peaceful and they're here to help and it's not it's not a cookbook <laughs> you know so all right everyone take care and uh, three days down, 
Only two to go before the weekend. Take care, and I'll see you again tomorrow. Hope everybody had a great Valentine's Day out there uh, uh, yesterday. If not, it's cool. I wished you a happy Valentine's Day. Hey, all right. Take care.